Good morning, folks. My name's the Second Son. Just about every morning I take a walk somewhere on this farm, and I see plants I don't know. I aim to change that. Today, I'm seeing this tree. This tree is absolutely gorgeous. It has these orchid-like flowers on it, these huge heart-shaped leaves, and the seed pod is this weird bean pole thingy. So, we're gonna ID this tree. With leaves and flowers this distinctive, the tree was not hard to find, and it is the Northern Catulpa. Northern Catulpa is an interesting tree. It is brittle, but it has also been cultivated for well over 200 years, mainly in Ohio, for its wood. It is also the sole host to the Catulpa Sphinx Moth. Now, if you don't know what a Sphinx Moth is, uh, they're also called hawk moths or hummingbird moths. And they're often mistaken for hummingbirds because they flap their wings so similarly. Another interesting note about northern Catalpa is that when it was first discovered back in the 1500s, its native range was described as a single valley in the U.S. where the Mississippi, Ohio, and Tennessee rivers meet. But later evidence now suggests that this tree used to have a much wider native range. And it experienced such a die-off that by the time we found it, the only surviving members of the species were in and around this valley. Isn't that fun? Anyway, my name's the Second Son, and I will see you tomorrow with another plant. Goodbye for now.